Ah, purple and blues. We're in cyberpunk territory now. Grid is an arcade style game where you're hacking by flying a ship. The hacking requires you to dodge some lasers and defeat enemies that are in your way. It's one of those extremely focused games that does one thing really well. Grid's beginning gameplay is great. It immediately trains you to shoot anything yellow and rewards you with points and an explosion. Thanks for that. The fact that it's in 3D brings the game to a different dimension. Sorry, I just couldn't pass that one up. I think generally the 3D works pretty well and gives you a lot to look at. Sometimes it is difficult to be oriented and I missed a few power-ups. It doesn't happen that often and didn't really bother me. It's just with the camera movement and the ship movement, it can just get a little wild. It is definitely something I got better at the more I played. Having the game in 3D could have made aiming more difficult, but they completely avoided that with auto-aiming. I imagine this was a difficult design choice because it doesn't let the player feel in control. You'll need to fly in front of what you want to shoot. In some ways this works really well and forces you to put the ship in precarious situations to progress. I'm much more in favor of this kind of active gameplay. Otherwise, the player would just have been in a corner aiming across the screen to be safe. I'm a huge fan of this aesthetic. My mind goes straight to Far Cry Blood Dragon and how much I loved that game. In Grid, you're hacking, you have a machine trying to stop you and all the elements work together to make you feel that. Also, just listen to this music. A few things you should be aware of as the game isn't perfect. I think a controller is pretty much required to play. You want the ability to move around in a circle. I just found circling the enemies to be the best tactic. Another thing, sometimes the screen it was so lit up with everything going on, I was distracted and had trouble keeping up. This was rare and did not really take away from my enjoyment. Just, just take note. I didn't finish arcade mode yet, but I believe I reached the final stage and suspect the game to be kind of short, so your enjoyment might come out of endless mode. There are also leaderboards, so if you're into trying to be number one, you'll be happy. I'm not gonna make the value judgment for you. It's up to you. My pet opinion of Grid is that while very simple and has a few flaws, it captures an arcade feel that combined with the cyberpunk feels pretty good. Thanks for watching. Here's a clickable to another arcade game, Molman Must Die.